Yeah, Man, I say we go right to the uh, game. What do you think? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, except you are not the Jet J Bell. I'll have to fix that on your turn. That's all right. <laughs> Let's put that. It's an homage, right? To it's an homage to our friend Jay. All right, so we're playing Squid Ink. This is a game about getting clout, putting your employees into the workplace, and then scoring as many points you, as you can. <clears throat> so employees that you and I get into this bottom tier, out of the mail room, but into the workplace, they're only worth one time multiples times yeah. their points. But if we can get them up to the next tiers, we can go to three, five, and seven. But bumping them up and down. Takes a little work because you gotta have you know uh, you gotta have the right numbers for that. All right, so I'll let you be the uh, well. Actually, we start out each with uh, two cards. Two so cards. deal us out two cards. Okay. One, two, three, and four. Take it, Reggie. Reggie OP. Reggie's too strong. And then we flip them over and see who has the most total. We have six. I've got eight. Okay. So I'll be the first player. And then we'll we'll always have three cards here. And Strongest player goes first. I think so. Mm -hmm. The one with the most cloud was first, because that means that you get the last turn, which, as you know, mm. could be very powerful, right? At least I know you've said it's pretty powerful to do that. Okay, so we've got on the board here uh, middle manager, the HR, and the headhunter. Now, on our turn, Jared, all we're going to do is we're going to pick one of these three cards, mm -hmm. and we'll either dismiss them mm -hmm. for their clout, which we can spread onto ours so that we can move them into the workplace. Yep. Or we can take them into the work, uh, into the mail yeah, room. Start building. But we only have three people to do that. Yeah. So uh, promote any other employee from this tier. Man, that middle manager. Both of these cards are great. Mm -hmm. The middle manager and the HR agent. Which yeah. one do you like better? Uh, neither of those. <laughs> so I'm going to take the one that you want. So. <laughs> I don't want either of them. Uh, oh, this is like, man, all three of these are good They're all cards. really good. I think They're I'm really going to take uh, the middle manager okay. and put them there. And I don't have any cops, so I can't get started yet. Uh, I'm going to take the hand. And once we fill up the board, Jared, that's going to trigger the end of the game. And we'll finish out the cards that are in the deck and the ones that are in the employment line. Unemployment line. Look at so. Sam. Is that choosing from the employment line me drawing a point from the deck? I, I had Sam last or time. It wasn't as good as I thought. You might, you know, you, you might play him better. So um, that floating didn't come into play when Lynn and I played. So I'm going to burn this because you're going to figure it out better than we are. So I can get three. Also, because yeah, put, it's put the only thing worth any cloud. Come on, put some cloud. Yeah, there we go. There you go. Plenty. And then, so here's the trick. I take the three clout, because mm -hmm. there was no modifier on that one, and then I've got to put it on only one uh, card on this board. Yeah. But if I can put it on one that has, a, a, where the clout will match up to that number, then I can promote it to the workplace. And the excess clout stays on it? And the excess clout stays on it. So okay. I'm going to spin that to, you have to, by the way, if you meet or exceed, you have promote. to move it over. Okay. And then I take the placement agent, and I get to pick anywhere it's supposed. You would think it doesn't matter, but it really does because there are cards that, that play with the adjacent rules. So, okay. And right now I'm winning the game. I want you to know I've got three points. And one clown to each of your other employees. That one was tougher to get into a good position. So, uh, you Yeah, all I can do is just take a little bit of clout there. Ooh, oh, Finny. I know you're going to take Finny. He's good. Oh, He's space for Finny. I know. Mm -hmm. Two space for Finny. Wait a minute. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually spin the three and see if I can. Now, now that I have cards in my workplace, I can actually split them up between the two. So I could put, I could put uh, two here and one. Iris seems very good too. Here, and then move the middle manager over. Uh, no, you can't do two and one from the same side. You can do oh yeah, that's sides. right. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah, Sorry, yeah. I had that card last time. I'm yeah. going to do that, so I could do that there. Okay, so I'll do two here. I'll spin the two, and that puts the middle manager in the box. You're up. Okay. Don't forget to bump up. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead. And, okay, so we have a security guard out. I'm going to grab the security guard. Yeah, I'm just going to get rid of him for six clout. So, interesting. Okay, so we do have to... One thing to note about the tiers is that if I pick from the middle, I get the clout of that number. 
If I dismiss the one at the top, I get a bonus of one. If I wait to the one on the bottom, it's negative one. So it goes by order and it's always going to bump up. So okay, so if I have six, I can get him and then... But you can't use him this turn. Yeah, so. that's fine. But now okay. you're set up to use him next turn. So. And can I get the... Which one is there? It? The restru restructuring agent. Nope. No, the restructuring agent. The... Um, Resources? Resources? No, restructuring agent. The pufferfish. Pufferfish. Yeah, there you go. Restructuring agent. What does restructuring agent do? Let's me push people. Oh, no. Yeah, I knew you would start the float thing. I had a feeling you would do that. Mm, okay. Um, I'm going to take Bella. Okay. And then I'm going to move an employee on this tier okay. to the next tier. Get away from that restructuring agent. Smart. Okay, I'm going to take this guy up here. Okay, you're up. Ooh, DJ. I'm going to dismiss self starter for three. And then I'm going to put them all on Bella. Okay. And spin the three to put Bella over here. Okay. Right. What's she do? Dismiss Bella and put an employee from your mailroom into the workspace. Yeah. So you get get them for free. Yeah. Bella the temp. Bella's just a temp. She just comes in, kind of does a little bit of work, and then moves right on. So I don't even know why I'm putting a token because she's she's not going to stay. I can't do Okay, so I just have one. That's a negative one, so that was, what did you just move it to? Yeah, okay. Okay. If you have four, you gotta move it, but that's okay. only three, right? Okay. I can't get any clout. I know, it's tough right now. Those are huh? weak ones. Those zeros sitting up top. The good news about the zeros is they go right into your workplace. Yeah, I don't have any space. I can't get any clout. Oh, yeah, you're in trouble. Huh? I'm stuck. I'm going to take Deidre and then move Deidre right in. Where's Deidre? Uh, Deidre go. Oh, no. Get away from that restructuring agent. <laughs> and then that's all I can do, right? Yeah. Okay. I do like Deidre, though. Out of the three zeros, Deidre's the one that you can kind of get some shenanigans going with. I'm, I'm okay with Deidre. I'll just take my three. Well, take three. Use two to come on. Okay, yeah. Okay. Brian's there. Hmm. Interesting. But I'm gonna just dump Brian for the five. Now I get to split them up between employees in the same spot. So I'm going to put three, of course, on here, and two, of course, on here. No. Yep. Yep. So I'm going to spin that to dismiss Bella, which moves Iris over. Where's I? Oh, you have Iris. I definitely want to stay away from my uh, restructuring agent. Okay, you're up. Three from it, so that. So I'll spend four headhunter in. Okay, um, and then I will spend the Union Jack to remove all your cloud. What? Yeah. Didn't you just move him over to the workplace? No? No, last turn. Uh, yeah. Wow. 
from an employee. Okay, well, wow, that stinks. That is less than desirable. So he needs a um, token? Yeah. Okay. And where's your third one? No, no, third one. You have three in the workplace. Oh. Oh, I never put you and Julian in there. No, it must be over here. He's a two. He's a two. Okay. He's a squid guy. Can I get that four, actually? You just looked it up. Where is, uh, where's your buddy? I don't know. He's a two somewhere. You. Oh, there he is. Jillian? Yep. Okay. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Do I already have a placement? I already have a placement. I'm going to take the employer. We're going to employ you from the employee line right to the workplace by spinning an additional clout off of the operator equal to the... Ch oh, wow. Modified by their place of mind. Interesting. There you go. We got nothing when it comes to clout right now, man. Alright, I'm going to take that HR agent, I think, because I didn't get to grab him the first time. There you are, another floater. This no. two to put this guy into play. Okay. A middle manager. Are you doing something? Yeah, middle manager. What? Put your token on it. Actually, let me put this right. Mm, right in the middle, huh? Yeah. I don't want you to drop it. <laughs> Belinda right there. Willinda? Willinda yeah. right there. I know, that'd be nice. Huh? Form the ability of an adjacent employee. All right, I'm going to get rid of those three because I need some clout. Where am I going to put it, though? Hold on. Let's see. Oh, wow. He's really neat. He's neat. I'm going to put move an employee on this tier. Yep. I'm going to put it here and one on here. Okay. Wait. One on here. HR agent. Yep. There. And then I'm going to use that power here to remote any other employee from this tier so that'll bump iris up you're up there we go how about that 12 point move you want some water sorry water over here um yeah well, yeah mm, i'll take a beer it's fine uh, actually i'll just take a water i'll just take a water, I'll just take a water. that's fine yeah uh, how about Mountain Dew? Is that yours? Is that your Dew? Well, that was mine. Yeah, I'll take that. Is that so? Mountain Dew never goes flat. So off to tier means in any direction? Yep. Okay. Yeah, if you, if you knock them off. We'll burn this guy to get four. What I'm going to do... Three and one, but I'm gonna bump your charge. Well, how are you doing that? Oh, because I'll put him next to you. God bless it. Well, the problem with the HR, if he's ever demoted, he dismissed. So he's gone. It's, it wouldn't matter either way. As long as you as long as you bump him, he's gone. <clears throat> Done? No, I can move an employee from the unemployment line to the mail room. You have the instructions? When do you refill? At the end of the turn or when it happens? Well, you take your turn. I'll look this up. So. Well, I, I need to know because then I might be able to grab them. On your turn, you choose an employee. Once you've done this, slide the remaining employees up as necessary. As soon as you grab it. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Ooh. Right. How are you taking that one? Move an employee from the unemployment line to your mail room. Nice. Yes, thanks. I'm okay. I'm good with that. 
You done? Yeah. I gotta give him a ton of clout, but... I know, I don't have any clout either, man. I, I'm gonna have to start getting some clout. So I'll get the two. Okay. And then I'll move Go the off. operator up. Where's the operator? Huh? Operator. Okay. Can I stay away from you or not? <laughs> I'm gonna burn this guy again. for four again. Let's go ahead and do two and two so I can get this guy here. Okay. Done? Uh, no. Oh. Mm. Okay. There we go. Burning him for three. I'm gonna put two here and one here. Then I'm gonna spin that. Move an employee from the unemployment line to the workplace. Oh no, I need extra to do that. Dang it. Okay. All right, you're up. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna burn this person for three, but I'll just float that guy all back down. Wait, floating? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, do I actually move this place? Off the tears where the is demoted. Yeah, so it gets demoted. So do you decide where it goes? Yeah, yeah. since you're the demoter. Where are you putting him? Ooh, who do I have? God, that restriction agent is... Whew. Do I have this guy on the board? No, I don't. Can I get number? Uh, number three, Lumberg. Yeah, Lumberg. Lumberg. Okay. Um, you need yeah. one. You need one of your purple tiles, right? I'm gonna push him. You need some clout. Why? Well, I, I did. I used it. So I burned this for three clout, and I just used it to. to yeah, to move me down, right? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. So I'm trying to figure oh, out where. Okay, yeah, yeah, I got. It. That's it. I don't like that. Your, your little engine takes a lot of clout, though. It's super news. expensive. That's the only good news for me. It's super expensive. That is the only good. I'm going to burn this one here because i I got to hurry up and get my guys out of there, man, before you... Okay, so this is a cool trick here, this operator. I can spend two to then spend more clout to put people right into the... Workplace. Yeah, so that one actually only cost me three... Which one costs you three? It only costs me three because it's modified by the um, the modified numbers. Wait, that that affects that? Yep. It says it says by spending additional cloud equal to the cloud value modified by their place in line. So it costs you four. It costs me four one. minus one is three. But it has to be one more than the card, so it costs you four. By spending an additional cloud equal to the cloud value of the card, so it's four minus one is three. So you need two. I already spent the two. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. Now I'm spending three more. This is costing me a lot of clock. Yeah. yeah it's cost me five clock to do this, but I get to do this one. Uh, yeah, I definitely want that. Okay, so I do that one. I'll put that there. Director, play. You have the director placement. I know I do. Oh yeah, definitely. And where's that one that you're messing with me on? The recon. It's way up there, up top. Ah, oh, dang it. Moved them out. Okay, well, I'm going to go here then. Okay. Because then I can mess with these two. Mm -hmm. Just takes a lot. Wait a minute. Yeah, it takes a lot of cloud to do that. Man, oh man. This is a very interactive game for, for not a lot of cards. It's very interactive. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to promote this guy up this one. Oh, thanks. Well, thanks. <laughs> I don't want you to mess with my guys. Man, oh man. I'm tempted, but once I put him there, I'm going to get screwed. I need to do it, though. All do right. what, sir? <laughs> I'm going to take Willinda and put him there. Okay. That's right. It's not great, but it's all right. I uh, know I wanted him next to the headhunter, but I, or the 
deconstruction agent, but I got to try to move them up there. This is interesting. I am clout poor right now, man. This is very interesting. All the cards are cheap, too. Mm -hmm. They're easy to get to. Wait, I'm missing one. Uh, the operator. Oh, oh, I accidentally put them up. That's where. Okay. What you thinking? I have no idea. Um, one second. I'll go ahead and grab this AR Troy agent. Yeah. Okay. Kendra the Temp. Dismiss Kendra and put the top employee from the deck into her space. Oh, I, I did like Kendra last time. That was actually pretty fun. And pretty cheap. Reggie! Okay. Mm -hmm. Missing the play on the next tier tomorrow. Oh, that's another HR agent. Okay. Um, all right. Time to get rid of the middle manager. Get Kendra going. I can't keep Clout because you got that stupid card. Oh, where's Kendra? Uh, no idea. Kendra the temp. Where do I want Kendra the temp? <clears throat> What you thinking? Don't know yet. Doesn't it seem like we've been clout poor all this, this yes. whole game where Linda had so much clout last Very time? Very clout poor. Oh! Is this our first security guard? No, our second security guard. Into the deck. So I gotta shuffle this deck here. Okay. You, you need to see the next guard? Hmm? No, I can't, do, I can't do anything, okay. so we're good. For a tiny deck, this, it's really interactive, man. Yeah. Uh, the reference agent. Resource agent. Draw an employee from the deck. Dismiss them from their cloud. That's a pretty cool one. It, it just it takes a lot of cloud to get it done, man. But... That coupled with um, Deidre is pretty cool because mm -hmm. you're, you're dismissing stuff and then spreading it out. Dismissing stuff and spreading it out for three. <clears throat> oh, hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know where I'm going with this. Look okay. at this deck I have, of cards I have here. You're definitely flooding me. I'm going to take five. Yeesh. So I can promote the director of HR. You didn't want Penny? I mean, Finny? I want the clout. Finny gotta... almost got me the win last time. Mm -hmm. I think somebody just didn't do anything to you. They could have totally messed you up. <laughs> they could have. You want to name names or you, you stay on that? <laughs> nope. Uh, they took it easy on you is what really what happened. That's what happened? They took it easy on you. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, but I think I'm going to dismiss them because I'm going to some clout. Hold on here. I need to put some zoom. Okay. Yeah. No manager. Kendra, all right, I'm going to dismiss Kendra, the temp again, the second time Kendra keeps going away, mm -hmm. and I put the top card on the deck into her space. Self-starter! Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. All right, self-starter goes here then. I'll take that. Wait, she goes here. You're up. Okay. I'm just going to burn this for two. Seems like we've gotten stuck with a bunch of these yeah. here. Yeah, it's definitely not helping. It's because Sam has just been sitting there forever. I need Sam. Sam's going to go here. Are you burning for two? Mm-hmm. Oh. Woo! Uh, I'm going to oh. burn Esther for four. Yeah, it's a good one. It's okay. a big one. Let's see. Yeah, I need to get that resource agent going. Okay. 
Get that resource agent going. Uh, oh, man. Is the middle manager the one that pushes? No. No, okay. that's the puffer fish up there. Yeah. The one who's not doing anything. I got a lot of yellow uh, tokens on the board, man. It's for two. Which I will spend all six. It's BJ and Jared. We're here in the Gumball Pot. We're playing day. Squid Ink from WizKids Games, designed by Ivan Turner. Very interactive. If you got any questions about the game, hit us with Very it. Very take that. I just missed your guy. Oh, what happened here? I just missed Iris. How? That's what she did. Just missing an adjacent point. Oh, wow. So it's discarded. That's no good. That's really rotten. Yeah. It took three turns to do it, though, because we only I wasn't even noticing what you were Another security guard. Here we're running that We are not climbing the corporate ladder here. We were just not. messing with each other. <laughs> yeah, we really are. <laughs> um... But I'm afraid to have Cloud because you used to have that card. Okay, let me see if I can still do, have it. Let me see if I can do something here. Yeah, if I put everything here. Okay. You can get a three cost. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Yeah. Not too bad. Or a two cost. Or I'll two take, cost. I'll take yeah. the middle manager and put the middle manager here. All right. Okay, I'm gonna dismiss this for three, two here, and one here. Okay. No, I'm gonna do two and one. Hold on. Okay, hold on. I'm just refill the deck. Okay, and I'm gonna. I'm gonna demote this guy. I'm gonna put him right here. Where's my HR? Where's my HR agent? Oh, did we never put it out? I don't know. Do you have one? Yeah, I should have one. Promote my HR agent. Okay. I'm done. All right. I'm gonna use my power to draw this. I'm just going to burn it for two. And I'm going to promote the self-starter to the next level. Nice. You're up. Okay. If we don't have a lot of the ones that mess with each other here. Minus I mean, I'm sorry, promote and demote. Three. We just keep messing with each other. Two. And I'm going to go and yeah, okay. Let's put that there. So I move Reggie in. Reggie, we're on a space. Reggie, Reggie. <clears throat> Some big money here. Let me try this one. Oh, dang it. Okay, so what happens? You play it, I'm assuming. Here, right? That. Brr. That's my whole turn. High risk, high reward, huh? Wow, oh, yeah, I guess so. I'll just do three. And I want to Okay. And I'll spend two to promote the director of HR. That's that's less than good. Here we go. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna do this instead. Or promote this guy right here. Yeah, can't use my soul star. Yeah. Okay. 
can't use either one of my middle managers. Dang it. That's no good. Can I use my restructuring? Yep. Okay. So I'm going to dump Brian for five clout. How do you. We don't have anybody who really. We promotes. don't have any promoting dudes. No, we don't. My, my middle managers are all stuck. I need something that can move yeah, and play. Okay, so I need to do that. How um, do you get? Oh, you have to use one middle manager to promote the other middle manager. Yeah. yeah. Oof. Wow. I don't, even, I don't know how to do that. Okay. okay. Hold on. I'm still taking my turn. Mm -hmm. I'm putting all this here and this here. So I'm going to spend the, the placement agent, which is here, okay. to move an employee in this tier to any empty space. So I'm moving down here so I can nice. finally use the middle manager. Then I'm going to spend the operator Ooh. two, and then one more to move the HR agent to here. Oh, <laughs> dang it. Oh, no. Okay, so we're gonna play out this deck. Yeah. And these cards. So you only have a couple of turns left, and you've got all the big points up here. I, I think you got me. I don't think I don't have the cards that can really mess with you right now. I'm just gonna get rid of this guy. This guy for four. Which lets me uh, Okay. I'm going to put four on this guy. I'm going to use his ability. It says promote any employee from one tier below him. So where is he at? He's right here. So I'm going to promote this guy to the HR management spot. Well, that's a good move because I was about to mess with you. And then I'll use my middle manager that just moved up to get my headhunter here. Oh, yeah, you got me now. Yeah, I think you got me. <clears throat> I had too many cards that are just worried about grabbing stuff out of the deck. Yeah. And not enough that could actually do anything. With it's it, hard. So. I didn't realize, but you guys had so many things that were promoting. But if you don't have promotion cards, you're just sitting down here. Because we kept dumping them for, yeah. the, for the cloud. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, man. Yeah, they just kind of sit there. You saw how much we moved. You yeah. Know? Okay, so do I have anything? That you I got have? the double mail manager, so, so if you can get those guys operating. No. Which they're free now. Yeah, but you oh, have, one of them's free. I can move one. I can at least bump that guy, and that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get rid of this for the four cloud. Mm -hmm. Put that on this middle manager mm -hmm. for sure. And then the other middle manager, I can't use his power because he's next to Melinda. And then let's see, what's another good one I can do? Oh, wait, I get to move this up and see what the next card is, right? Mm -hmm. That could that did not make a difference. Okay. Nope. Um, God, my HR agent is just in the wrong spot. Okay, so then I'm going to um, promote any other employee from this tier up to there and demote your middle manager, which is just going to not going to do anything because you're going to just mm -hmm. use the middle manager to do something. Okay, I'm sure. Can't bring him anywhere else. Yeah. I don't have anybody who's high oh, enough. Okay. I don't, oh, I do. I do. Right, you're up. Yeah, I'm just going to spin two. And I'm just going to. Oh, it's four. Yeah, two. Yeah, That's right. I'm going to promote this guy up. To that spot you just took. What? How big is he? Oh, a six. Okay. Give her up. <clears throat> so that I can get rid of for three.
Yeah, this is a punchy game. Oh, this yeah. is not a nice game. Playing this with four people would seem crowded. I can see three people not being too bad, but four people might feel a bit crowded. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to spend these two okay. to move Walenda up to here. Nice. Which I should have done before, huh? Mm -hmm. Long, long, long ago. Yeah. I was trying to take that spot, though. Yeah. And then now I can use the HR agent to demote an employee on the next tier. It can be any employee. Any employee on the next tier. So I'm going to demote this one. Move the HR agent up. Nice. The only problem is the HR agent cannot be used again. Okay, that's okay. At least I got at least I got you out of the way. We'll see if that works. I mean you still you still get the uh, if you can get that big six up. I can. Yeah. Do I want to though is my my thing? Let's move. F four. Don't know what I want to do. I'm just gonna do it. Okay, I will just re-promote this guy back up. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Which one? The six. But I'm gonna take this one. Moving that one down. Where's my six at? Right here. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna burn that for two. Oh, wait, you have any more? <coughs> Can I mess with you one more time? <laughs> Hmm, I don't think I can, right? You guys are pretty weak. They're not very you don't have any very big big numbers. No. I've got rid of my one big number. The one big number. Yeah. Alright, so about the only thing I can do is um It didn't take that long. It's like forty three minutes. I know. It's a, it's a quick game. Okay, that guy can move up. He'll switch places with the HR agent, right? Okay. I think I'm going to do that. Watch the shenanigans. You know what I'm doing? No. I'm going to promote the self-starter above my HR agent. Which gets rid of this HR agent? Oh, crap! It does, huh? Mm -hmm. Anytime he's dismissed, he's gone. Yeah. Plus, you were going to put him next to Willinda anyway, so you couldn't use his ability. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it wasn't as smart as I thought. Yeah, it was not a very good idea. Okay. And that's it. Dang it. Yeah, I forgot about that. I'm just going to go ahead. You know what I was going to do? Is I was going to use the HR agent to move your uh, director down. <laughs> but I forgot about Willinda, and I forgot that it gets dismissed. I'm just going to be promote. <laughs> ah! Yeah, you just cleaned me out. It's not even close. Security agents blocked us all over. Oh, wait. It says it doesn't matter. It doesn't Once matter. the in-game is triggered, it's yeah. triggered. Well, that's it. That's it. I don't even think we need to count the points. You got a million. <laughs> you got, oh, my God. You got 40 points just right here. Uh, yeah, that's what, 20? It's like 38. I have 18. 19 points. Yeah, that's not even close. We're not going to count this score at all. <laughs> this is really bad. <laughs> 47. 56. What's up? 61. 73. This 73? is exactly the kind of game you're good at. 75. It really is the kind of game you're good at. You know, doing little tiny things to move stuff up and down. Messing with people. Even though I hate playing games that are this interactive, like I don't like I don't mind a little bit of here and there interaction, but like you like tapestry, the only interaction is Toppling somebody's tower over, yeah. which isn't even that big of a deal. Were you mad that I toppled and that I put that little piece next to your piece right away mm -mm. with the traders? No. No, no, no. Did you notice? No, I didn't <laughs> notice at all. I, I, I just wanted to see what the new alchemist would right. do. But. 
I mean, that's what the power does, so I did that. Yeah. I was following all your moves, and I keep falling far and further behind. I don't have any resources, and I haven't been able to produce resources. It's not a good ground. I got, that, I got that one thing where you can move three of them down and jump another one three up. So mm -hmm. let me take all those weak actions again. Oh, I mean, cheap, yeah. not cheap, weak. They're yeah. all powerful. Isn't that weird? Tapestry has powerful actions at the very start. Mm -hmm. you know, And it, let me take them all again. So I... I the it is punchy yeah as jay likes to use that word it is definitely punchy but it's punchy in little tiny spots mm -mm. only one in other words it's those little moves moving up moving up the only real punch was whenever you got rid of my six to be honest i have the punchy cards this guy lets me swap two positions yeah so even if you climbed up i was going to move you all the way back down yeah and then that guy just let you that's why dismiss. i put that's why Not i put walunda demote dismiss yeah. an employee yeah, no, that's pretty rough. So, as soon as you had Iris, I was like, okay, well, I have this person. He's got to go there and dismiss before and, he moves Iris. And I was trying to keep an eye on him to make sure that as soon as you got close that I would do something. You know, put Walinda next to him or something. But, yeah, yeah I was paying attention. Well, that is Squid Ink from... It's punchy. It's, it's very not, punchy. It's, Plays quick. Well, I think three players are probably better at two. I think two players just feel so punchy. I'd love to play the three players. I think, three players, that, I think so. three players might be smoother. Yeah. My film that was the artwork's pretty cool. I actually yeah. like the little cartoony uh, artwork. Uh, Jay said it was all, it was bordering on creepy, <laughs> right? Some of them are creepy. Yeah, some of them are really like that guy Limburg. He reminds me of like Monsters Inc. You know? Yeah, some of them are very Monsters Inc. -ish. Yeah, like look, um, that's the one from um, Nemo. Yeah, Nemo. Yeah. So, yeah, but uh, bordering on creepy, like almost Mad Magazine creepy type things. So. Yeah. All right, Squid Ink. It's a quick playing little game with cool art. If if you like interactive games, and there's it's very people that like it, it's gonna be interactive. But I don't think it's it's gonna be one of those things where somebody's gonna cry at the end of the night. It's not like you're investing a lot when somebody punches your six. You know, in other words. In fact, I think I got the six for free, right? Uh, I did. I used you that. Played it for free. Yeah. I did that card that let me. Play I think it you got it at the beginning. So yeah, you technically got it and played it for free. I never spent any money on it. Yeah. Um, so. I think finding the engine of this is going to be fun. Like we had, I don't think we had terrible engines. If we were to play with somebody who had an actual engine, I think we would have just well, got destroyed. But what a totally different game than the yeah. way that you you watched me and Linda play right before that, and we had this way more interactive thing about moving up and down. We, ours was much less messing with each other on our boards, yeah. though. It was all about moving people up and down, up and down with those HR agents and the uh, middle management. So Yeah, we yeah. didn't have much HR agents. I would definitely play this with three or four players. I, I wouldn't mind doing that.